Lucky Me is quite a delightful film and a little bit quirky and I think that's all because of Doris Day's character. This film was released in 1954 and it's directed by Jack Donahue, written by Irvin Ellenson with story by James O'Hanlon and it stars Doris Day and Robert Cummings and also Phil Silvers. And the description from IMDb is as follows. Three struggling theatrical performers meet a famous songwriter who is trying to convince a wealthy oilman to finance a musical he is scripting promising them stardom if it comes into fruition. To be honest, I feel like that doesn't really get to the heart of what this is actually about. For me, the driving force behind this is Candy Williams, played by Doris Day. I love her character. Because Candy meets Dick Carson, our our famous celebrity songwriter, but she doesn't know who he is. She just thinks he's a random person. And he falls for her and... Suddenly, her life could start to change. But I, I mean that—that's obviously very cliche. We see that thing kind of a lot. I guess the fact that she doesn't know who he is makes it maybe a little bit different from this kind of usual film. But I just love seeing Candy as a character coming to life, and she's got a really great bubbly personality, and she's high energy and full of, you know, full of enthusiasm, and. I just can't fault her as a character. Obviously, Doris Day's performance is absolutely spectacular. And I love I love seeing her in this. I love just watching her and, you know, just seeing her perform. I think she's absolutely fantastic. This is hailed as a rom-com musical. The musical aspect, yes, that's definitely there. The rom-com? Mm-hmm. I think... Well, the romance aspect is very interesting because it's obviously because because of the difference between Candy and Dick Carson. It's quite an interesting development in their relationship. And certainly in terms of the comedy, I think it is is quite funny. It's quite entertaining. And it's one that I would, you know, I definitely kind of recommend if you're into quirky films. And... Basically, if you're into Doris Day, because I love her. It's not one of my favourite Doris Day films, absolutely not. But in terms of her characters, there's something about Candy that I absolutely love. Also, Eddie Foy Jr. is in this. Um, He plays Duke McKee. There isn't anything about the film that I think didn't work. As I said, not my absolute favourite Doris Day film, but I thoroughly enjoyed it from start to finish. I can't find anything about it that didn't work. There is nothing I think they could have done better. Um, I'm sure there will be, but the the choice of setting as well is brilliant. We have several different locations keeping things fresh and exciting. The music is great. The costumes are great. Doris Day is great. The performances are good fun to watch. Dick Carson as a character is certainly very interesting. Candy as a character is absolutely brilliant. I can't fault the film if you get a chance to see it. In fact, if you can make the opportunity to see it, Please do. I think you'll really like it.